Hello, my name is Jack Scott and I'm a senior at the Miami Valley School. Um, I took a course called In the Footsteps of the Buddha, um, taught by Mr. Squires, and this is my final. It is a video final. Um, here we go. So uh, the first thing that caught my eye in the Buddhism course was um, the fact that Christianity or other religions like that are, are typically um, referring to sky goddesses or gods. Um, but Buddhism is a religion that is focused on the self and the power that's within the self. Um, and this is very different from any Western ideas that I've ever come into contact to or uh, any of my friends have come into contact to. Um, so I thought that was really cool. Uh, but... But this is important because... Um, we can learn, this is important because we can learn how to get out of our own heads and into our body, which is something that Western culture has just push, pushed us so far away from. Um, and when you get out of your own head and actually into your body, you can start to peel away concepts and um, expose reality for what reality is instead of what you keep telling yourself it is or what, um, you know, what your experiences are telling you that it is. Um, Um, the next thing that is super related to the last um, is when Mr. Squire said, if you are angry, you are half a step away from compassion. And this was uh, kind of crazy for me. Like I, I instantly typed it in my, uh, my learning log and I've been thinking about it almost every day because I get frustrated a lot. And um, like just the other week, my mom didn't pick me up from the school. And like, I was really just mad because she said she would and then she didn't. Um, but I was at the school and I kind of just sat with the anger and was just like, okay, like, why are you doing this? And I kind of laughed at myself in my own head, um, and called myself out for, for being angry. And I was astonished at how just relaxed I was after that. And how I was just kind of like, okay, like, it's not that big a deal. There's no reason to be this frustrated. Um, and I think that that is implications with every emotion so that we can better understand ourselves. Everything from, I mean, love to hate. Um, it's really interesting. Um, but the Buddha says that there is suffering everywhere and it's how we choose to react to the suffering that's important, not, um, not being, uh, neurotic, not being a neurotic person is, is very important and like hurting, hurting others in that way. Um, the last thing I'm going to talk about is the sandwiches that we made in class. And this shouldn't have been like... Like, none of us thought this would have been as big of, of an event as it was. Um, and we're redoing it today for our final just because of how much we all loved it. But we made these sandwiches, and they looked super gross, and they kind of smelt gross. But when you bite into it, it's, like, one of the best things that has ever existed for sure. Uh, and so what, what's to take away here is that we think we might not like something, or we think we might not like someone... But it's important to just try, try it or try and have that conversation, that new conversation um, so that you could spark something that, that has never happened before. Um, but at the end of making all the sandwiches and we were making the sandwiches and we were eating the sandwiches and teachers were coming in and out of the room and other classes were coming in and out of the room. Um, and then we started playing music at the end. I like felt... Uh, I felt like... I felt like I was like tearing up or like really emotional, which was weird. Um, and I, I don't know like where that, where that emotion came from at all, but I think it's me being, or I was directly in that experience. We were all directly there doing it, just experiencing and being great people. And I'm curious at what else I'm not experiencing like that. Because if making sandwiches almost brought me to tears, I'm very curious about what else I'm missing out on. Um, and the last thing I'll leave you with is, I want to love life, and I want to have a desire for it, and I think that Buddhism is helping me walk down the right path of that, and helping me find the, the hidden truth to something, I don't know. Uh, but it's been a great class. I would recommend anyone to take it, or any of Mr. Squires' courses. They will change the way you think, and you just can't be afraid of that.
Thank you.